There we go. Hello everyone, this is Al Kabir, the analyst, and today I'll be talking Green Bay Packers, Amari Rogers, putting in work, and um, third round pick, they drafted him really high, this is the highest since Devontae Adams, this is Al Kabir, the analyst, um, Amari Rogers, man, putting in work, um, I've been trying to react to all the workout videos as much as I can, look, eyes black, just looking up videos all day. So, um, but salute to Amari Rogers, third round pick. Green Bay Packers really don't draft wide receivers high. They either go with the undrafted guys and get somebody off the street, and these guys can play. Devontae Adams, once again, that was the highest pick since him, but they usually go cornerback, linebackers, you know, things like that, which I'm not mad at because you look at Jair Alexander. They drafted my guy Eric Stokes this year in the first round. So they, they typically don't go high on wide receivers. That could be the problem that Aaron Rodgers had with them. Another story for another time to me, if they go Aaron Rodgers or either Jordan Love, I think they will be okay. Green Bay is really good with transition and quarterbacks. So, um, back to Amari Rogers ran a four four four. Um, he's five nine. He's not that tall. Um, but I believe he's he he got that breakaway speed. Whereas though he he can be a problem. You can run bubble screens with him. Maybe I underestimate his deep route running, but he can break away, and I could see him getting some snaps on um, this season and wilding out and going off for a big one. I can see some bubble screens, just some screens, maybe some slants, and um, he can be a problem. He can open up a couple games. Then you got Devontae Adams, still got Valdez, Scantley, things like that. So it would just open up the field for this guy. I think he can be their own. I don't know. Randall Cobb. I, I think he could be on um, Cobb for them again. And that that's high hopes. I mean, he had third round pick. They expect him to play. So, um, salute to him. He he looked crisp on that little route that I posted. So, I, I think he's going to put in work this season. I'm not saying a thousand yards. I know, I know fans like to go out like that. Um, salute to the cheese heads. But I know y'all like to go out like that, um, meaning like no super high expectations. But he can get like four or five hundred and um have a decent rookie season. Um Aaron Rodgers is on the team. If Aaron Rodgers is still on the team, I know he'll find them. Um if Jordan Love is that start starting quarterback, like he said, he'll be ready week one. I know he'll find them. So Mari Rodgers, uh, safe to say this, I think y'all made a good choice. I really did. Um once again, undersized, it is what it is, but he got the speed, he got the talent, he can play, his route run is good. Nothing to really complain about this guy. Um, I think he's underrated. I think a lot of people's not talking about him. That's why I talked about him. So, Amari Rogers, man, salute to you, Green Bay Packer. I see what you can do next year, but what do you think and how do you feel about Amari Rogers, man? Will he... Be that dude. Also, I'm shooting this off the phone just in case you hear a little background noise. The family's here. So um, I still got to put in the work. I can't post these guys putting in work and I'm not putting in the work. But this is Al Kabir, the analyst. Ghost.